The JH-7 Flying Leopard is a unique Chinese fighter bomber. It has been powered by a British turbofan engine for almost two decades and is one of the last purposely built fighter bombers left in major military powers. The JH-7 was actually designed surrounding the British Rolls-Royce Spey 202 turbofan engines. In 1970s, United Kingdom offered China a batch of engines which started phasing out. To make it useful, China started the JH-7 project based on Spey 202. It is believed that United Kingdom or France might have offered assistance in design stage, resembled an enlarged version of European Jaguar attack jet, but this was never officially acknowledged. The JH-7 is an old-school design, there is no stealth technology and not even flight performance close to the third-generation fighter jets. It is in many ways a pure ground attack aircraft. Due to lack of modern fire control radar, the JH-7 had been restricted to Chinese Navy anti-ship role until the mid-2000s. Online posts that the JH-7 might have a takeoff and landing flaw that quite easily flipped the plane, causing casualty and loss of lives. Similar accidents had occurred a few times in China, but root cause not announced. However, even with the issues, the JH-7 is still a successful anti-ship jet for almost three decades in Chinese Navy, and now with upgraded radar and weapon, the upgraded JH-7A is taking on ground attack role as it was initially designed. The JH-7 is reported to be the first in China designed using computer software, paving the way for more Chinese fighters being designed with virtual and 100% digital technology. The British Rolls-Royce Spey 202 turbofan engines were used on British F-4 Phantom fighters, roughly 200 engines were handed over to China. The engine ensures the JH-7 can easily achieve supersonic speed with reasonable range. Chinese Navy gave the JH-7 a Type 243 radar, capable of detecting large warships around 200 kilometers away. And it can carry two IJ-8 anti-ship missiles, plus two fuel tanks, and two PL-5 or PL-8 short-range air-to-air -air missiles. One IJ-8 missile can easily sink a frigate or damage a destroyer. The upgraded JH-7A has a JL-10A pulse Doppler multimode radars and modernized avionics, glass cockpit, and new data bus. It can deploy KD-88 air-to-ground missile, IJ-91 anti-radiation missile, and laser-guided bombs. It has entered services starting from mid-2000s. The JH-7 have a combat radius ranging around 1700 kilometers. It has an internal twin-barrel 23mm cannon. Starting from late 2010s, the plane often carries electronic warfare pods, plus optical sensor pods to detect, track targets, and control laser-guided bombs. Around 215 to 240 JH-7 as remain in Chinese Navy and Air Force. The jets have frequently deployed abroad for joint exercises with other countries. Chinese Navy also operates J-16 fighter bomber which is based on Sukhoi-27 platform, a much more advanced plane comparing to the JH-7. However the JH-7 will stay in service for at least another decade. Thank you for watching this video. If you like this video, please subscribe, share and comment. It will really help us developing this channel and bring you more videos about Chinese military news. Thank you.